Hello everyone. To solve this problem, we're going to go ahead and use the fact that sine squared plus cosine squared is equal to 1. So I can replace cosine squared with 1 minus sine squared, can't I? So that gives us 4 to the power sine squared x plus 4 to the power 1 minus sine squared. But I can write it as 4 to the 1 divided by 4 to the power sine squared because when you divide exponents with the same base, you subtract the exponents and you can also go backwards. Isn't that cool? Now, this is equal to 4. Now, this calls for substitution, doesn't it? I can call this u or something else, whatever you like. u plus 4 over u is equal to 4. And from here, what are we getting? Let's go ahead and solve this equation. Multiply everything by u. u squared plus 4 is equal to 4u. And when you write, uh, bring the 4u to the left-hand side, you're going to realize this is actually equal to u minus 2 squared equals 0. Beautiful. That means u is equal to 2, right? If u is equal to 2, that's only one solution, by the way, but u is equal to 4 to the power of sine squared x at the same time. But 2 is square root of 4, which can be written as 4 to the power of 1 half. Uh -huh. We got the same base, so the exponents have to be the same, which means sine squared x is equal to 1 half. But that gives us two solutions. Sine x can be 1 over root 2, or the opposite of that. What does that mean? If you think about the unit square, sine x is 1 over root 2. If x is equal to pi over 4 degrees, but when it's sine negative with the same value, right? It's either the third or the fourth quadrant. But what do you think is going to happen? Well, there's actually more than one solution. You're going to look at both the third and actually second quadrant also gives us a solution. I forgot to mention that. It is going to be pi minus pi over 4, which is 3 pi over 4. And then we're going to have the other x values, which are, let's think about it, pi plus pi over 4, which is 5 pi over 4. And then 2 pi minus pi over 4, which is 7 pi over 4. And there you go. You have four solutions and they all seem to work. Thanks for watching. Bye.